Alright, here we are. I'm so glad I won free tickets to see this band on the radio. I think they were called Something Die Something or something? Why must metal bands have such graphic names? Agreed. Let's go. Wow, look over there, a real mosh pit. You like want some mosh? No, Marlon, wait, I, I don't think... I don't think you should have gotten in there. Mosh pits can be dangerous. I thought they were gonna be giving out mosh potatoes. Turns out they thought I was the potato. I hope you all die! I'm gonna kill you! Well, if you don't like the music, then why'd you come to the show? I wanted to flame you in Max! Whatever, douchebag. Now we're gonna premiere our new single. The song is called... Death. In the darkness! Can we turn off the lights? Here we go. <laughs> <coughs> Wait, that's not part of the song! Turn on the lights! Turn on the lights! Oh my gosh, our singer Dick Astley is dead! Oh, oh, oh my god! Oh my god! This is horrible! Everybody remain calm! I am an undercover police! And I'm placing this whole building on lockdown until we can find out who's responsible for this! The killer could be anyone! Any one of us! But I have a feeling it was you! <gasps> you were trash talking the band the whole time! No, no, it wasn't me! It was. I didn't do it, I know it, it was the drummer! I swear, he posted on Facebook this morning that he was gonna kill! KILL! No, I said I got new drum heads this morning, and I'll be killing it! So you think he's not human, and you killed him with your new drumsticks? Who are you? What? That's preposterous, who would do something like that? So it was you! I had a feeling it was you the whole time. Mr. I knew Lee, it! I think you're jumping to conclusions. What if someone like me did it? Ah, a confession! No, 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 I didn't mean that, I didn't, I'm not yeah, guilty! Yeah, yeah, save it for the trial, Orangey. I know you're guilty! Whew. Hey, don't you act all innocent up there. I know you were in cahoots with him. It was probably a three-man job. You, Orangey, and Orange! Oh, but, but I was just sitting with my friends the whole time! Oh, so now your friends are in on it, too? I'm starting to think this whole place is guilty. Well, there's only one way to sort this out. I've got to interview everyone individually to get the story. And I'm gonna start with you, because, I mean, personally, I'm a big fan. Oh, well, <laughs> thank you. Morlin, why did you do that? Now you're a suspect. I don't know. Now they're gonna interview me and ask all sorts of questions I don't know the answer to. Okay, well, Marlin, he's going to interrogate you, so I better show you what an interrogation will actually be like, okay? All right. Okay, Marlin, he's gonna sit across from you, and the first thing he's gonna do is take out a knife. Now, he's not gonna use it, but he's gonna threaten to cut off your nuggets. <gasps> How does he know I have chicken nuggets in my pocket? Oh, he knows everything. Now, Marlin, the next thing he's gonna do is say that he's on your side, but really, he's not. But how can he claim that when he's not on my side of the table? It's an emotional tactic, not a geometry lesson, Marlin. Now, it's important to say that you're not going to speak without first talking to your lawyer. Who's my lawyer? That's the thing. You don't have one. You see, the interrogator won't get to ask you any more questions because your lawyer doesn't exist. Now, if you're going to take away anything from what I just told you, remember, never ever... Alright, it's your turn. But come I with me. Talking to, I just I'll tell you later. Just one more second. Come on, come on. <sighs> well, he's doomed. Oh no! The knife! I'm gonna cut off your nuggets. Oh no! Not the nuggets! Listen, I'm on your side. Oh no! Not the sheeps! Oh, what was that other thing I was supposed to say? <sighs> oh yeah! I'm not supposed to talk because I'm a lawyer. Well that's handy. You can represent yourself in the trial. And listen, I got some uh, parking tickets that I uh, maybe you could take care of. They just won't go away. No, that wasn't it. I'm not a lawyer. It was that my my lawyer is he's like invisible. He's like 
He's invisible. He like doesn't exist. Ah, changing your story, huh? Classic murderer. But listen, I'm gonna be honest with you. I did it. What? That's what I want you to say to me. Now listen, if you just confess right now, I can, you know, help you out. Work my magic. Maybe shave uh, two or three years off your sentence. I'm sorry, I've never been good with the grammars. Don't you mean hiding your evidence? Hey, why is everyone in here a suspect but you? Because I'm an undercover police. No one would ever suspect an undercover police of killing a guy. That's why I took the opportunity to kill him. I went up on stage, took a knife, and stabbed him right in the back right when he was about to sing that... I mean, uh, uh, yeah, I'm talking hypothetically. I didn't, I didn't really do that. I'm, I'm not serious. I'm, I'm talking what I would have done if... Uh, no, no, please don't. Please, hey, everybody, please don't. everybody over what? here! Huh? Who is it? The undercover police is really an undercover murderer! He's the one that killed the guy! Ah, and I would have gotten away with it too if it weren't for you metal kids! But wait a minute. I am gonna get away with it. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll get him. All right, guys, let's go. There's a ledge there. <laughs> he's dead. I'm sure glad he's gone. <laughs> That's right. You guys can suck it. You know why? Cause metal music sucks. Everybody knows it's always been about Elvis! Now come on! Let's get out of here! Woohoo! You guys are all reckless teenagers! Yeah. Somebody hand me your rocket launcher! Here, take mine! Well, I guess we learned one valuable lesson today. Never win free tickets from a radio station, because when you actually get to the show, the singer of the band will die, and then you'll be all entangled in a murder mystery, and that will end in rocket launchers exploding an aircraft out of the sky. I think you guys owe me dinner. Something warm is seeping out of my butt crack onto my bed. 